Hello and welcome to a new video. In this video, we'll talk about how you can create custom face mesh lenses. So you can create effects like this that let you manipulate the physical features of a face. Now to do that, you need this, a reference face mesh model. I will leave a link in the description from where you can download this. Now, once you have this file, I want you to open it in a 3D software. Any software that allows you to sculpt uh, can be used for this. Blender, Z4D or even Nomad Sculpt that is available on tablets and iPads. Let me delete this cube. Let me import the reference mesh. Now we have it here. Now let's go into sculpting. Let's turn on. <coughs> let's turn on symmetry. Let's create a simple Hanuman lens because recently the Hanuman movie came out. Let's grab the inflate tool. inflate here increase the size radius and strength so there i've done a simple sculpt for the face mesh let me export it file export and remember to export it in fbx that is the most ideal format for lens studio fbx and you can also add materials and textures to this face mesh if you have added any materials and textures remember to do this step go into path mode select copy and select this small button that is embed textures so when you import the model all the textures come with it but we don't have any textures here so let me go back to auto mode and export it so now that we're in lens studio we can use a template instead of starting from scratch this is something that i learned from Paige, who's a very big AR creator and she posted a tutorial recently about the same thing about creating face mesh uh, lenses and that is where I learned about you know using the template which makes the whole process a lot easier let's go into search look for face morph so what I'm going to do is, is delete the two examples here you just need the first one enable it go down to the mesh and don't change the mesh here right click select go here here you will see external face mesh. This is what you need to change. Okay. Select, click on plus and click import and import the mesh that you exported earlier. Go down, mesh, face mesh, select. So now we have the face mesh imported. Now once you have imported it, you will see the changes in preview. If you're not happy with it, you can obviously go back and re-sculpt your mesh and do that trial and error process. Now if you come here to the mesh, you will see that there is a slider here. This is why I told you to import it here under external face mesh instead of replacing the mesh here because this allows you to switch between the original face and the sculpt that you did. If you bring it down, it goes away. If you bring it up, it comes back. Which means you can trigger this blend shape using a behavior script. Go into objects, flip a scripts, add a behavior script. Make sure it's at the bottom. Whatever event you like, touch or mouth open, eyebrows whatever have an event and in response type look for set blend shapes once you have that select the face mesh name you will find it here external face mesh make sure it matches it exactly and what do you want it to change it to okay so before we do that let's make sure it is at zero and let's set this to one so now what's going to happen is when we tap it's going to change it from 0 to 1 that is enable the blend shape let's see what happens when i tap here you see that it enables the morphed face mesh that you have input into the lens so with that you now know how to create custom face mesh effects if you want to learn more about lens studio and watch other tutorials make sure to check out the playlist that i will link somewhere here that is it for now i'll see you in the next one